Hey everybody, Standing Ovation back with another break, and I got the new Upper Deck Series 1, 23, 24, it's here, finally, Hobby Box Series 1. I have been waiting for a little while for this to come out, like everybody else, and actually not as long as I thought, because they bumped up the release date a couple of weeks. This was originally supposed to be out on November the 1st, but uh, here we go, it's first box into the new format. They've changed it as we are aware, or 12 cards per pack, 12 packs per box now as opposed to the 24 that's the hobby format there's just as many inserts if not more but the base cards there are less of them and perhaps that's a sign of the times way back in the day people used to build base sets but not as many people do that anymore all the group breakers and whatever so here we go 12 packs as opposed to 24 I'm not sure how I feel about it yet I, I like base cards I What's new this year? What's different? Well, it's a lot like, I mean, this is Upper Deck's main brand. They're not, they're, they're not going to change it that much. So it's still a 250 card set, 50 young guns, 200 base cards. It's still got the standard inserts of the honor rolls, the portraits, UD canvases back, although their young guns are one in 24 still. So you're, or sorry, the canvas young guns. Yeah. They're one in 24 packs. So maybe one in every other box. There are other, some, there are some new inserts though. The first uh, of which is called 200 by 85, the dimensions of a hockey rink. There's also black parallels of those. Uh, there's a new one also called Star Surge with red die cuts. They're one in 240 packs. I would imagine those are hobby hits. Dazzlers are back. The pink and, uh, and all the different rainbow colored versions of Dazzlers, depending on the product format. Special edition Star Zone Teacher's Pet are all new, e easier to pull inserts. From what I gather, there's three inserts in every pack, if not more, and parallels too. So there's going to be a lot of inserts, a lot of sorting, a lot of fun. Here we go. Series one, upper deck. The Young Guns checklist. Oh yeah, I forgot. Well, I haven't got it right here in front of me, but the big names that people are going to be chasing right off the bat are Luke Hughes out of the Devils organization, third brother in the Hughes family, and Matthew Nyes off the Maple Leafs, although he hasn't got a point yet. He's uh, He looked good in preseason. There's a few players that are already drawing in interest. Askarov, the goalie in, in uh, Nashville, and Devin Levi, although the, 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 the big draw to this, though, what the biggest change of all, they made one of ones this year that you can get. They paralleled the Young Gun set. They call them the Outbursts, and they look good. They look really good. Outburst Silvers, Deluxe, which are numbered to 250, Reds numbered to 25, and the big ones, Gold 101s. And those will look really cool. And some, I, th I think, I hear people are putting bounties on those cards already, so be watching for your one of one hits. You can also hit printing plate one, one of ones, which you know, I'm not expecting a one of one out of here, but I am really looking forward to the new format change and design. And Let's see. Base cards look good. Perhaps they shouldn't have reduced them all. They do look familiar, though. Upper Deck's base card design hasn't changed a lot this year. What does that look like? A lot like last year or a couple of years ago? Anyway, there's David Perron. David Perron of the Red Wings. Mikey Anderson, LA Kings. Rasmus Dallin, the new multi-millionaire in Buffalo. Adam Lowry. It's a quick peek at the back. We'll go through these a little slower at first. Dallin, Anderson. They basically just crop the image out the front to put on the back and change the background yeah adam lowry and my first insert is a cole caulfield special edition second insert is a rookie retrospective forgot about them they're still in the checklist subsets peter kochikov first young guns jackson stauber son of rob and uh, Buffalo, or Buffalo, Chicago goalie of the future, maybe? I don't know. How good is Jackson Stauber? First Young Guns is a goalie. And there is my reasoning for Upper Deck. My petition has not been started or gotten very far. But Young Guns, change the name there too. Make them, I don't know, make them Young Ones or something. But a goalie is not a gun. And a Young Guns is a stupid name for a cool goalie rookie card. But whatever. Forsberg, Ben. Aho, Slavkovsky, and Connect Me. So I thought they said there's less base. Well, there's still a lot of base here. So I guess with less cards, less packs, you're going to get less cards overall. Let's see what's next. We've got Ryan Pulak, Joel Pavelski, Vitek Vanacek, Logan Couture, and what's this? The Teacher's Pet. Oh, well, that's kind of cute. Report card of the member, you know, you get your stars. You're you know, good for Scott Lofton. Apparently, he's a teacher's pet. And the portraits design, they actually look like portraits now. That's kind of, that's kind of funny. Andrew Vasilevsky with his little, 
Game of Thrones look going on there or something. I don't know. Cool looking canvas cards. Fazzy, that's the back of the portrait. In it. Canvas. Beauty Canvas. Brendan Gallagher. It's got the blue bottom this year. There are black parallels as well this year. Hobby only hits. Hamilton. Zach Hyman. Elias Lindholm. Aaron Eckblad. And Ivan Provorov, although he's no longer with the Flyers. I forgot to mention the price of these boxes are 150 Canadian on release date, depending on where you are. Uh, but I think that's going to be the average price for across the country. I'm still thinking, there's Brad Pesci, there's going to be some sort of Easter egg hit of Bedard. Maybe I'm just hoping and thinking that, but Ben Sherratt, Kirby Doc, Oliver Ekman Larson, Seth Jones. We got an exclusive. Johnny Tavares, right on with the St. Pat's jersey. Johnny Bedsheets, Johnny Tavares, Johnny T, Johnny Toronto, John Tavares. Okay, that's enough. Next, Tavares. Tyler Toffoli, Star Zone. There is red die-cut versions of these two, apparently. Yeah. Young Guns, Tristan Robbins. Uh, born in London, England. Well, right then. Brilliant. Johnny Goudreau, Johnny Hockey, Andre Vasilevsky. That's a cool shot. With the puck almost up and over him, or who knows. Evander Kane. There he is. Raphael Harvey Bernard. As they say in Montreal, who needs Bernard when you got Harvey Bernard? They're loving him in Montreal. Okay, well, three packs down. They're liking it. I'm liking it a lot. But it's upper deck, and it's hockey cards, and it's going to be hard to upset me on this stuff. It's Samuelson. Isaac Lindstrom, Lundstrom, Jacob Slavin, Evan, even Bouchard. That looks like my first Dazzler is a Maple Leaf, Willie. Willie. Right on. I like the color match, and I like the Maple Leafs, and I like William Nylander, so that's a good three-way round hit for me. There's the new stat box fillers, Brady to Chuck. Yeah. What's this one? Superstars on a roll. Sid Crosby. I like the design this year. Very bright kind of card. Ottinger, Nick Dowd, Braden Shen, JG Peugeot, and Juicy Juso Parsonin. Taylor Radish, Dawson Mercer. I like the old school jerseys there. Old school jersey jersey. Matt Murray, spending the season in the press box or in the uh, operation room. Hopefully he comes back. He was great while he was healthy. Couple Keckle. Tage Thompson. You know what? I didn't see anything about French variants on this. I didn't read anything about French. They're in here. There's another one of the star zones. Nady Mac, Nathan McKinnon. Willie Cooley? Willie, Willie Cooley, maybe. That's it. And Luke Hughes. What's this? Young Guns behind him. Well, that's cool. I got my Luke Hughes. Let's make some room for that one. And there's a nice Young Guns hit right there. Luke Hughes. Let's put down my base. One of the uh, big popular players right now. He's a defenseman. I mean, it's not like he's going to be the next Paul Coffey. But he's another Hughes brother. And... Okay, Luke Hughes gets the first stand of the year. Right on. How many Hughes? I mean, I don't have any Jack Hughes right now. I do have a Quinn Hughes. But how many Luke Hughes will I go through before I actually keep one? Because generally this product gets sold for me right off the bat. And I, I collect it down the road. But as I sell cards on eBay, which if you're interested in buying and these or other cards, check me out on eBay. I, I use the same name there. And if you're at it, tap the like button on this video. It really helps me grow this channel. keeps it going. Supporting the channel any way you can. Like, subscribe. Throw a comment down. Okay, here we go. Morrissey Horvat. Lucas Dostal. Eh, it's Cody Glass. Star Surge. Shane Wright. Didn't make the team this year, but I still think he'll be back. Luke Hughes. Debut dates. Star Surge. Where did I put the other Star Surge? That's my first Star Surge. Like, wow. All these inserts. Wow. Debut dates. April 11th, 2023. Versus the Sabres. Luke Hughes made his date. And there's Aiden McDonough. McDonough. Luke Hughes. Aid McDonald Young Guns, the Canucks, from Milton, Massachusetts. Indeed, Aiden McDonough. Philip Grubauer. Kirill Kaprizov. 
Kaprizov, Tyler Sagan, Dan Vladar, and Michael McLeod. Yeah, it definitely feels like an Upper Deck main brand product. I like the design. I really do like the design of the Young Guns. They, they look good this year. Bear Banoff, Robbie Fabry, Marcheseau, Sergei Bobrovsky, Danny Malgan. I like the old school Colorado Rockies. He was with the Leafs for a short time there. Oh, here's one of the new 200 by 85 inserts of Nico Heischer. Okay. Nico Heischer, 200 by 85. There's a hockey rink. Behind him is a honor roll of Elias Pettersson. Well, it's kind of like this. Is it acetate? It's not acetate, but I like that simple home, away, away, home, away, away, home, home, away, alternate. But no, that's not there. Elias Pettersson. Canvas. There's my Pettersson pile. All mark. Mr. Goal scorer. Thomas Hurdle. Hurdle. Petrangelo. Hey, there he is. What? You think you're Matthew DeChuck there? Everybody. Keep your mouth guards in. It just looks gross. I mean, are they that awkward? Go back to the old school and you didn't wear mouth guards. You just got all your teeth knocked out all the time. Like my good old Gordy. He didn't have any teeth. Well, he had some. Mason McTavish. Robert Thomas. Connor Timmons. Logan Thompson. We got a Stevie Stamkos. Steven Stamkos. What's going to be behind him is another one of these stat box fillers of Eric Carlson, no longer with San Jose, obviously. They, I think they did all right trading him away as he was not going to stay around. Another portrait of Sveshnikov. This one looks like a little bit more like the Vincent Van Gogh look. But yeah, the portrait set, they really, I mean, that's important to have a hockey card that looks like this in your collection. Because you might want to hang it on the wall. Right? Youngin's Canvas. Not a Starenko. Okay, these are one in every other box. So they're maybe not as rare to hit when you think about it. Nikita Nestorenko. Son of Eric Nestorenko. Another former NHLer. From Brooklyn, New York. Suzuki. Hall. Schwartz. Lindholm. I really do like Series 1. Or Series 2. All the upper deck. Basically, I like hockey cards. Thanks, Captain Obvious. Cole Perfetti. Jordan Eberle. Matthew Joseph. K. Andre Miller. I like that shot in MSG there. Very familiar score clock and ceiling. Kyle Connor. Special edition. I still see some of his flow. My first acetate clear cut. Trent Fe Frederick. Frederick. Trent Frederick. For the Young Guns, Tyler Clevin behind him. Number 12 in the set. Tyler Frederick, Austin Bruins. Tyler Kelvin from Fargo, North Dakota. Oh, yeah. Wow. From Fargo. Yeah, Fargo. Nate McKinnon, Arbor Jackeye. Sidney Crosby. Whoop. We got going on here with the little damage in the foil. Series one checklist, Rick David and Stammer with Connor Garland. Adam Fox, Kubalik, Cousins, Kaliev, Teacher's Pet, Miko Ranton. That's a really ugly picture of Miko Ranton. In. Double F, Philip Forsberg. Oh, what's this one? On a roll. Superstar on a roll. It's a starburst, or a, what do they call it? An outburst of Kirill Marchenko. And that'll probably be a good popular card. One, I think they're one per box. You do get one starburst per box. Now, it might be silver, a deluxe, a red, or a gold. Now, obviously, that's silver. Three silver, but I really like those. And these are the, the gold 101s will look like this. And I think that's a good thing. Although some people don't like the fact they made 101s in parallels with the young guns. Asim Kadri. Yeah, and the back design doesn't have anything distinguishing it. They might have wanted to put just on the back, just saying that's what OPG does and tops when you get a hit, just to distinguish it on the back. I really like that, though. That might take over the popularity of clear cuts. Okay, I'll have to dress that up. Kadri, Montour, 
Boldy, Latang, and Seth Jarvis. Okay, two to go. One more after this. Patterson, Kuznetsov, Kucherov, Anders Lee, and Rupe Hintz with a star surge, Cole Caulfield. Second Cole Caulfield insert in the box. There's a debut dates of instant Iorio. Iorio? Iorio. Here's the star surges. Vincent Iorio. He's got the little mouthpiece problem too. Okay, it's a Young Guns. This is the last one in the box, is it? Whoops, it's Nikita Nastarenko. Okay, that's cool. That'll go with my canvas. Day butt dates. Where are my day butt dates? Nastarenko. From Brooklyn. Where are Fulton Cards knows him. Hey, Fulton, shout out. Nick Sealer, Matty to Chuck, David Yurchik, and Mark Andre Fleury. On that note, on shout outs, shout out to Builder Boo. I see you. Uh, all, I watch your videos, and I noticed you met your uh, your breaker there the other day, GP. Another guy I I, I watch, and and I actually been in a couple of GP sports cards breaks. It was cool to see you both in your video. I am uh, I'm again watching all you guys out there. Dynasty, shout out to you. I noticed. Uh, thanks for the. Shout out to your video, Return Trip, Return Back Right At You. Those are channels I like to watch if you guys don't watch them already. There's other ones I watch in there too. I mean, everybody watches some of the certain ones, but these other guys are out there having a lot of fun doing the same thing I'm doing. You might want to check out their channels too if you don't already. Okay, last pack in this break. First box of Series 1. I've enjoyed it thoroughly. And I will be doing more, so keep watching the channel. I'll have more of these. I might do a double box break, because now I'm getting better at editing. I might be able to shorten them into uh, two boxes per video, but we'll see. I don't want to overload on the stuff, but I am going to rip a lot of this, so I might as well video it all. Shabbat to Chuck, Cut and Yemi, Caden Gould, and Frank Petrano. Okay, my last insert is a 200 by 85 Johnny Tavares. Johnny Hockey. No, that's Goudreau's nickname. Your Johnny Betsheets. An honor roll, Kapriusov, and a canvas of Gabe Velarde. Is he with the Jets? Darn it. No, he's not. Does it say on the back he is? No, it says LA. Well, Series 2 or an update or something. Kingston, hey, shout out to Builder Boo again. It's not good to drop your cards. It really isn't. That one seems like it's, well, it's made of canvas. We're good. We're good to go. Carry on. Josh Anderson, Zabanajed, Swayman, and Arturi Lekkonen. Well, I got to say, out of the box, I got a good Young Guns. I got six, like you're supposed to. Estorenko, I got in doubles, in a way, because I got seven Young Guns, technically. And again, hobby boxes, you'll often get more than six if you do include your canvases or your clear cuts or your parallels. Again, I don't think there is French in it now, as I didn't notice any French variants coming out, which that'll upset all the people in Quebec, but nobody else, really. Okay, well, let's pick them all up and, and just go through them, because... You get a lot of inserts this year. They said they wanted more inserts, so they got more inserts. Okay, well, let's do this. Quick review. Let's, well, before I do, let's properly address the fact that I did not... I couldn't stop. I, once I got started, it was like, don't stop. But I had to... I should have done this earlier. Treat your cards properly when you get good ones. Dress them up. Take the time. Admire them. Appreciate them. There you go. Okay. Okay. Well, again, my young guns pile. Nestor Ankle. Kel Clevin. McDonough. Tristan Robbins and Jackson Stauber. So I'd say probably Stauber and obviously Luke Hughes here were my best hits. But I did get another Nestor Ankle in the young guns canvas. Other canvases of the base, I got Velarde, Olmark, and Brendan Gallagher. Uh, again, blue blue bottoms on the canvas this year. Purple on the Young Guns. Johnny Tavares was my UD exclusive, number 48 of 100. I like the gold foil. Looking good. And again, another Maple Leafs hit for me in my Maple Leafs collection, which never seems to stop. It changes all the time, but there's a Nylander Blue Dazzler. Kachikov, rookie retrospective. Tavares, another leaf hit with Nico Heischer. Portraits for Zveshnikov and Vasilevsky. First, Cole Caulfield. The star surge with a Shane Wright. I got the debut dates of Iorio, Hughes, and Cooley. 
superstar honor rolls of Kaprizov, Forsberg, Pedersen, Crosby, stat box fillers of Carlson and Tuchuk, special editions, Connor and Caulfield, so the two shiny Caulfields are there, and star zone, Nathan McKinnon, with teacher's pet, whoops, star zone and Toffoli, and uh, Lofton and Rent and teacher's pet. So these inserts will probably get to be, you know, 25 cent bins, maybe a dollar for some of them, because of course you're gonna end up being tons and tons of them. I'd say these inserts may have a little bit more popularity. I don't know why, but I just think the dual-sided cards will have more popularity. Dazzlers are always popular, and canvas and exclusives. Oh, I forgot about my retrospective. There's probably a jersey version of that coming out in a retail format like they did last year too but there you go the hobby hits again a frederick clear cut and a nestor ink or a marshenko outburst silver outburst thanks for watching everybody keep on collecting standing ovation out